Hi, and welcome back to High Tech Diamond. Today we're going to be discussing charging the Tech 11 polishing pads with the diamond paste. We get a lot of questions asking, how do I do this? Um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is to remove the backing of the polishing pad. And don't feel bad, I did pre-start this so that it didn't take me um, you know, too long to get this done. But you're gonna go ahead and just peel that brown uh, paper backing off. And then what I like to do is I like to center it over the hole, putting that down first, and then pressing that out. So super simple. You will have a little overhang, and that's okay. We got pretty good there, nice and centered. And so then the next thing we're going to do is begin applying the diamond paste. So what I typically do is I will put a drop about every one to two inches, kind of varying the depth that I have it on this. And I'm going to stop here because I'm going to have a little extra on my fingers that I can spread around. I'll go ahead and add a few more drops. So as you can see, about every one to two inches. And I try and make sure I have it at all of the different depths that we will have as it spins so that you have good coverage and it hits the stone well. Another question we get is, great, now I've got it on here, I've been using it. What do I do later on? When do I, when do I need to add more? So typically, um, what I'll do is, add, you know, if I've left it for a while and I come back to it, I'll add a few more drops each time as I restart. Another good indicator is if as you're working you find that the stones are not polishing as well as they used to, then you may want to go ahead and add a couple of drops. Some other helpful hints for polishing that I've received from, um, from users is to, depending on what your material it is and how soft or hard it is, experiment with the speed that you are um, using on the machine while you are polishing. With harder stones, um, I've been advised if you go a little slower that oftentimes you'll get better results. So don't be afraid to try different things and see what works best for you. I hope that this has been helpful to you and we will see you next time.